As this bioeconomy grows, it's very important to have analyses such as the Billion Ton Study that are taking real data from the fields as we're doing research on, on feedstock productivity, identifying opportunities for yield improvement, and translating that to what it means for a national resource availability. So the Billion Ton 2016 is the third in the series of these Billion Ton reports. The first, conducted in 2005, answered the fundamental question, do we have enough biomass resources to make a meaningful impact in our petroleum consumption? Oak Ridge was chosen for this analysis because of our expertise in feedstock, feedstock analysis, and economic analysis. This third analysis in 2016 adds more technical rigor to the analysis and attempts to look at the question of what is it going to take to get these resources to market. You know, one, of the, one of the real surprises to me has been the, the volume of data and really cutting edge data that has been generated by uh, this, this group of researchers and, and uh, uh, with, within the study. We have a lot of confidence in what can be produced. We have a lot of confidence in are learning more about the, the uh, impact of different uh, management practices on, on yield, on water quality, on other sustainability metrics. To try to meet that billion ton uh, effort in the billion ton bioeconomy, it takes sustained support uh, for feedstock in feedstock logistics throughout this entire process. And, if, and, and by its very nature, a billion ton means we need a billion tons of material. Now what's important on all of this is that ensuring that we have feedstock materials that have quality attributes that are appropriate to meet uh, grades and standards and create a, a commodity that is tradable, the conversion uh, processes require. I'm so proud to be part of this. I'm proud of the, the team. Um, it's, it's diversity as well as its breadth. The work that goes into putting out a product like this is, is tremendous. It's really a capstone for a lot of the, the research that's going on in the, the feedstock supply as, as well as logistics space. In this update to the Billion Ton study, we've included algae, realizing that it has tremendous potential as a bioenergy feedstock. It also um, established an, an extensive network of uh, um, field trials of researchers of skills uh, and uh, science skills in particular that have allowed us to to really elaborate and I think further identify questions around um, that challenge of producing and, and uh, supplying 1.3 billion tons of biomass.